Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, again, don't mind my appearance. I look disgusting. Uh, but anyway, I wanted to share with you guys a quick little trick that you can do if you don't have a lot of makeup or if you are just running on the go and you're needing a quick fix for, don't mind me, I'm just fixing my hair because I hate looking bald. Anyway, um, if you need a quick little fix um, for the eyes, if you don't own that much makeup and you don't have any eyeshadow, or you just need a quick little awakening in the eyes and you don't want to pull out any eyeshadow palettes, I'm going to show you a little trick you can do to give yourself a nice little crease area. So if you want to see what little trick I have up my sleeve, then just keep watching. So the little trick I have up my sleeve is to use bronzer um yes makeup is universal i want to make that known um you do not have to use your makeup for just what it is solely produced for um yes foundation is used for all over the face as a base but if you have a i don't know a reason to use it as a concealer you can use it as a concealer you can use it as whatever you want honestly you can use anything at whatever you want i've seen people take the inside of the the mascara product because they have such dark eyebrows and use it as a brow product to fill in their brows it is universal you don't have to use makeup just for what it is solely intended for um so yeah I am just going to take the bronzer, open it up. Yes, I've hit pan. This is the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. I'm gonna take a blending brush and just swirl it in there. Get it on the, get the product on the brush, and then we're just gonna pop that in the crease area. And you're just gonna do this in back and forth blending motions, making sure to keep this in the crease and darker in the outer corner that is how i like to do my crease color if i'm doing a look and i'm doing like a crease color i love to keep the outer third of my eye very very dark um i don't like it to be light on the outer corner just because i think it gives it a little bit more flare when you do that and you just keep it darker with the eyeshadow now, you guys are going to be astonished because I'm almost done. And I had everything else on, mascara, everything else is done, full face is done. And we have a nice little warm crease. Now, as you saw before I put this in my eyes, my eyes looked nice, but they could look nicer. Um, so... I did add some depth into my eyes with using the bronzer as a crease shade. This just warms up the top of the eye. It makes the crease a little bit darker. So it has some depth, which makes your eyes look wider. Excuse me. Um, so, yeah, that is my little trick. And that little trick took 3 minutes and 33 seconds. I think that's pretty good, especially if you are in a rush and you are on the go and you just had enough time to put on a full face and mascara and you don't have enough time to do the eyeshadow, the liner, the brow highlight, the inner corner highlight, everything like that. Just throw on some mascara, pop some bronzer in the middle of your eyes and your crease area and you're good to go. It looks like you tried. And that's the point. It's not tried, but it looks like we did. <laughs> um, yeah, so that is my little tip for you guys on what you can do if you're in a rush or if you don't have any eyeshadow palettes and you're new to makeup and you just want to try some things out, um, just take a blending brush and plop some bronzer in the middle of your eyes. Um, yeah, it's pretty simple. There's not really a technique to it. Just keep blending, keep practicing. Um, blending takes a long time to practice doing. Um, it's just finesse in the hand. Your hand will get used to doing the motions and it'll be like easy peasy once you've done it a million and one times. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions about that, just drop a comment down below. Uh, I post a video Monday through Friday, so don't forget to subscribe before you leave and turn on notifications to be notified for when I post videos. And yeah, if you guys just want to chat or leave a comment down below, I will get to it eventually. Um, for some reason, my phone does not let me reply to comments. 
and my computer is a piece of garbage <laughs> so i am getting your comments i do see them thank you for every single comment anyone has ever left me um i do appreciate all of you all the time um i'm really glad that i have um you guys that like my video and it's really important to me because i am trying to put out um reliable and good information to you guys not to be like i don't know professional or anything but i do want to put out good content and yeah so if you any even if you have any constructive criticism on me and my content um drop a comment down below because i'm always looking to improve my videos and my content or if there's any video ideas you want me to make for you so you can see it just drop a comment down below as well and yeah i don't think i have anything else to say except i'll see you guys in my next video bye